Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma 2. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am, and today we are going to continue the main quest. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Now, I do want to explore a little bit around here first before we get started. Welcome, sir. Doubly so if you're here. Looks like some cool gear. Looks like more fighter gear. Goodbye. Hope to see you again. No purchases to be made today, I see. I just hope the shopkeep understands. The Arisen is ever prudent in the application of coin. A group of bandits has been terrorizing the roads of late, targeting our ox carts and the cargo they carry. They call themselves the Coral Snakes, and they are no common thieves. They are organized and deadly efficient. And worse still, they are without scruples. They have been killing and stealing in equal measure. Devils, the lot of them. What say you? Would you lend your aid in catching them? Sure, I'll catch these thieves called the Cordal Snakes, I think you said? Many thanks, sir. I should be glad to know someone is doing aught to help us. You all begin by scouring for their hideout. It must be somewhere near the highway, for that has been their primary target thus far. Mayhap you could learn aught by speaking with some survivors of the raids. Maybe we'll do some side missions first. Say, did you hear? There's been another ox cart raid. How many is that now? Dunno. But I'd wager it's the work of bandits. Gotta be them coral snakes again, eh? Sir Lissandro's been iron hands in a bit to flush them out. Though they haven't found them yet. Well, if they're not caught soon, we'll be seeing shortages. Mark my words. Wonder if they're part of the surviving group or something. I lack information pertinent to this task. Consider hiring a pawn better apprised of such matters. You guys survivors? I follow my whims. Where's... We've naught to discuss. No greater joy than... Okay, no survivors there. I shall suffer none to disturb... Many of our citizens view pawns as bringers, yet so boundless is Empress Nadinia's mercy that even lowly pawns may benefit from it. Twas she who decreed that no pawn may be forced into unpaid servitude or subjected to acts of violence. Oh, how magnanimous her heart! How generous her spirit! All pawn. Oops. Didn't mean to skip that dialogue. Monster. Looking to lay your head, we've soft beds aplenty. Pleasure doing business with you. Go on, have a look. I'm just grateful I get to lead a quiet I'm life. starving, I am. Food? Have you any food? Sure, here's a beef steak. Many thanks. And I didn't even realize I had food on me, to be honest. I'm still very hungry, so if you've any more food to spare. I think I do. Let's go check go our on, storage look. here. Looking to lay your head, we've soft. We'll give him another beef, uh, or beast, not beef. Whatever, I guess it could be beef. But we'll give him another beef steak. Beds are plenty. Many thanks. Thanks. 
Spare some charity for the poor. Ah! You there! What do you think you're doing, huh? You keep your hands off him. Don't go thinking you can treat the poor however you like just because you're better off. Uh, calm down, Hugo. You've got it all wrong. This kind sir has been good enough to share some food with me. I've the both of you to thank for my good health and my full belly. Is that right? I suppose I owe you an apology then, cuz. In my defence, one can't be too careful. There's a child snatching scoundrel around nearly every corner in these parts. The name's Hugo, by the way. I'm a helper of sorts to the poor who live here. Ain't many folk willing to offer that sort of kindness. Even just one more's a glad sight, let me tell you. So pay me no mind, and I'm sorry for before. If you're here to help... Many, many thanks, sir. Lucky I am to have the two of you looking out for me. I keep accidentally skipping dialogue. I apologize, everybody. Well met, sir. Need a room for the night? We're gonna grab some beef steak out. Three. Pleasure doing business. Just because we're gonna be doing some traveling. Let's see what this quest that we got. Mercy Among Thieves. The coral snakes are based somewhere in Batal. Determine where their hideout lies. I don't see anybody else to talk to over here, so I'm going to assume that we need to just... As a matter of fact, low that I am to recall the events of the coronation, they are fresh in my mind still. How might the technique used to control us be dispelled? I lack information pertinent to this task. Ooh. Consider hiring a pawn better apprised of such matters. I don't think I can ah, get no, up there though. Here's a surprise. A splendid discovery. Ha! Ah, I'll have to remember to tell my own master about this. Yeah, I can't get over there unfortunately. Very well. I shall return. Well now, this is a nice surprise. Care for some tea? If you're here in trouble, I'd fain come to your aid. Hi, <laughs> you've a bit of a special place in my heart. This is for you. Oh, cool. Baron. Baron's childhood home. A well organized pack is my speciality. Oh, my God. Leave me alone, Pawn. Jesus. What about this kid, can I talk to him? I invited myself along. No such thing as too much training, eh? I plan to keep it up, just like Baron taught me. Till I'm even stronger than you, stronger than anyone. Ah, you're welcome to stay a while, if it pleases you. Okay, so I guess there's nothing really else we can do with Baron. Come to think of it, we're all of differing vocations, aren't we? Our respective abilities are unique as well. We must each of us hone our skills. A jack of all trades is a master of none. Wow. Looks really pretty. Golden almost. So, after breaking free of the chains of slavery that once bound you to this land, you return of your own volition. This is good. I am relieved to see that you are fulfilling your charge. Now, it would be advantageous for you and your pawn to visit the Rockmaster's borough in Bakbatar. Methinks it is where you will find that which you seek. 
Never. There's been more trouble, as if we needed it. Happened right near here, too. I'd bet my left boot, twas those coral snakes behind it, nowhere's safe anymore. Seems they've slipped past this checkpoint and gone right into Batal. What did they put all that effort into honest work like the rest of us? If someone doesn't put a stop to them anon, we'll all be sorry. A city can't function without a steady supply of goods, and fewer and fewer carts are making the journey. They say you should be thankful for your life, but simply being alive isn't the same as living, eh? Huh? The trouble happened due south of here. It will be those coral snakes again, I'm sure of it. Well, that was super random. Oh, don't fall. <laughs> that was scary. There's a camp spot. Oh, and a, um, crap, Chimera. Couldn't think of the name for a second. Looks like it's getting dark. Hopefully there's a campsite close by here. Perhaps this will seem of little consequence, but some masters rearrange their party at the drop of a hat. Look out! Knackers! Fire won't do much good here. Best try at getting attacked. Knacker's horn. My word, this ox cart has been destroyed, wrought by the hands of brigands or the claws of monsters. Caution would be wise, but we ought not let it halt us in our course. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. Whatever it is, I shall You have my protection. I know I've said this before, but that lightning really does mess with your eyes. Because it just comes out of nowhere. How very inspired. I cannot wait to return beyond the rift and inform my own master of this. Hopefully we can find a campsite soon. I don't know what this is, but that's where we're going to be heading. Just keep following it down. Oh, shit. Skelly boys. One of us has been silenced. These fiends are only truly defeated when their skulls are smashed beyond repair. There it is. I'm like, man, where did the mage skeleton go? Forge fell from the beast as it breathed its loss. Where'd the head go? Is it gone? 
Freaking everywhere. Still don't see anywhere to camp. The sky is radiant this night. I feel at peace to gaze upon it. I quite agree. Master, I found a campsite near here while I was journeying beyond the rift. Shall I take us there now? Yes, please. Arisen. You know it. Nice. Two thousand gold. I'll definitely take that. Thought I heard some enemies. You've nowhere to go. Oh, I get you. Certainly arisen. How might I be obeyed? My curative magics are at your disposal. Wait a moment. Ooh, a fig. That's a first. We haven't picked any of that up yet. Let's eat something. We're just gonna skip through it. We've already seen this stuff. What say we get some rest? I'm not sure I could face a trek with my belly so full. Let's continue down this road. Glad we found a campsite. Now we can actually see. I thought there was an enemy that fell down here earlier. There they are. Wolves. Big old wolves. Where'd the other one go? Down over here. We've got them on the run. Let them run. We need Red to wolf fang. Who are you? What would you with me? You looking for the coral snake's hideout? Don't ask me. They were on us before I knew what was happening. Couldn't even guess where they... <clears throat> Come to think of it, it was as we passed the crags to the west of here that they all came out at once. I had a clear view of them from the back of the cart. 
That's all I know. I ran for my life. Only reason I'm still here. Thought I'd come back, see if aught was left. But just being here again puts my hairs on end. You know what? I just remembered. There was a child traveling with us. Wonder if the lad's all right. That's the second time kids have come up in this quest. Hopefully there's not like a slave trade or something with them. I think we're getting close to our destination now. I heard him, but I didn't know where the hell he was at. Nice, Riku. Wonder if up there is where the coral snakes are. This isn't much of an advent. First blood's always the sweetest. You all right? Halt, I say! Who? Fight. I'll have you! Pursuing yon bandit may well lead us to the fiend's hideout. Come, master. There is not a moment to lose. Not gonna say anything? Who are you supposed to be? Let's go follow where your dude went. It's about time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? Oh god, what is that noise? Dead end. I think we should... Be careful. He ran down that way, but I wonder if there's anything over here. Seeker's token. Cool. We actually got quite a few Seekers tokens in this episode. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. Oi! Have you lost it? A child was hurt during today's raid. We don't hurt children. That's the rule. Don't tell me you forgot. Sorry. Must have slipped my mind. It's like that, is it? Huh? That what you're gonna tell Lenzo? He says we don't hurt kids. So you better... Hold it! Who's this, then? We've got an intruder. I'll go warn Lenzo. Coming here was the last mistake you'll ever make, cuz. I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon. But at least I know I am up to the challenge. Try not to get hit, lest all that vim go to waste. Fall back, and I will heal you with my magic. Wait right there. Revive? I'm not reviving these guys. Why would I revive them? 
They're obviously bandits. Come out and play, son of a... Oh, what a jerk. Come on then. Where'd you scurry off to? Come on then. Ow. Rouse the flames before it is too late. Yes, master. I shall hasten to your aid. Get back here. I knew you would prevail, master. I dare say, the Arisen could have defeated this lot without us. Outstanding. I'm glad that you put that much faith into me, but I highly doubt it. Get back here. How the hell am I supposed to get down there? I guess right here. Where do you think you're going? Get back here. Say, does this foe not remind you of a certain someone we've met? What are you doing? You're in the midst of battle. Help! Hello, guys. Good God. Just about died there. Well, not really just about died, but I did get messed up pretty bad. I guess Linzo is not a good guy. Or not Linzo. Whatever the other dude's name is. By the skin of our teeth. What fails to destroy us only in half Linzo is a guy that the dude, I guess, was going to tell. Guessing that he's the big boss. These halls are labyrinthine. We ought not to wander heedlessly. We mustn't lead the Arisen astray. Let us be mindful of our surroundings. Let's, yeah, let's go over here. No, can't get over there. Count the number of meats and fish that have gone to rot in my pack. I'm gonna enjoy You'd think the smell would remind me. Ah, oh, yes. That sounds familiar. Don't destroy the bridge. The hell's wrong with you guys? I am honored to be called to your side, Arisen. Cool dried meats. That'll come in handy. Oh, you know what? I think we were supposed to go that way. Yeah, I went the wrong way. Looking around real quick, admiring the view. It's really dark in here. No, no, no. Am I going to make it? Come on, 
This way. I need to get you out of here before things get bloody. That's what Lenzo said to do, if we ever got raided. So come on, you lot. We're going to go see him. He'll keep us all safe. I'm sure of that. They're already here. Run for it. Well, maybe Lenzo isn't really a bad guy. Maybe he's protecting these kids. Visibility is poor here. Be wary of enemies lying in ambush. Keep your eyes peeled. Seems your luck's run out. I'd sooner not battle those with whom we have no quarrel. Yet if they mean us harm, we can but defend ourselves. You have my support. That was thrilling. I did not know I could feel so alive. Well, now you do. Come on! Don't drag this out! <sighs> Certainly arisen. How might I be of aid? Stay with me, arisen. Wait a moment. It's in this junk pile. Soothing brew. Cinnamon bark. Here. This path seems rather promising. Do you mean to proceed? My, you're a bold one. Excellent work. Well, that is a long way down. I don't stand a chance. My thanks. We shall accompany you now. Those coral snakes must pay for their crimes. We shall join you and aid your efforts however we can. Give no quarter. This appears to be the coral snakes' hideout. Got some backup. If we capture their leader. The other bandits might be brought to heal. I quite agree. Damn, they're everywhere. No wonder they gave us help. Oh shit! Arisen. Twould seem I've some catching up to do. Outstanding. Damn it. Like falling off. And... Holy shit, what is going down? Just the camera's shaking like crazy. Is a strange sort that ventures willingly into darkness. Oh, well, you know. I like to live dangerously. Decapitator. Some rabbit pelt. Oh, shit. There's more enemies. I thought they were all dead. Oh, 
You'd think these bandits would be like, fuck this, I'm out of here. There's a ladder here. Ah, oh, excellent find. Of course they would point out a ladder. Man, that lightning really throws me off every time. I never get used to that. Any more enemies? I'd sooner yep. not battle those with whom we have no quarrel. Yet if they mean us harm, Ow. we can but defend ourselves. You have my support. Whatever it is you need, I shall gladly oblige. My curative magics are at your disposal. Wait right there. Reckon you can do as you please, eh? That's what I'm talking about. Not to look forward to but a long day of work. Poor Lucy was looking for a high five. I walked right by her. <laughs> like, not today. Looks like I looted everything. At least for the most part. Nope, I see a chest off in the distance here. We have found a material. Bee steak? Sure I think we got plenty of bee steak. Fun. Okay, that was a little weird. Damn, Hugo! We're out of time, lad. We'll have to scarper. Come in, lads, though. Ah, but, uh, before I forget, <laughs> here you are. <laughs> <laughs> Time for you to make yourself useful. This isn't the first time I've taught an unseasoned whelp the meaning of betrayal. <laughs> and it shall be the last! <laughs> Goodbye, lad. Don't be sore. You were a fool. But a useful one. <laughs> I can't believe it. Arrest him. Lenzo. Why? The job well done. It is unfortunate that their leader escaped, but I very much doubt the coral snakes will be using this hideout again. We'll interrogate the lad and see what he knows. Mayhap he can tell us all of the leader's whereabouts. The coral snakes are still an enigma. Mayhap the lad can tell us more. It was painful to behold how callously the leader treated that young man. He shed him like an old boot. We all hoped for a better outcome. Yeah, that was pretty messed up. Ooh, 
Ooh, Frosted Edge. Oh, nice. They do more damage without even being upgraded. Yeah, let's put those on. Although, I think I'm going to switch vocations over to the mystic spear i think it's called if all feels out of place or magic spear will be a trap remain alert and naught shall catch us by surprise i want to try that out that looked really cool in the gameplay trailers where are we going by the way where is this What quest are we on? Okay, so visit the tavern. I, I'm not even, <laughs> I ain't even gonna do this quest at this point. Oh, there's that ailing Arbor Heart. We could probably do that next. Looks like it's not too far. Yeah. So we'll do this and then we'll go over to the Ailing Arbor Heart. And then maybe a case of Sculptor's Block. Goodness. We're higher up than I thought. Take care not to fall. Careful now. Got super dark. Where did Papa sell that? Come down right here. Over here. And then right here. But where are we at? Oh, I think I know where we're at. Let's hop down. Ouch. I didn't think I was going to take fall damage from that, but I guess we were a little high up. Certainly arisen. How might I be of aid? By healing me. Heal me, Lucy. Heal me. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait a moment. That ladder's around here somewhere. Where the archers volley. Their arrows can pierce us from beyond our line of sight. Careful now. That mage tried, but they failed. Spectacularly. Level 37. We're almost level 40. Jeez. You're all out of luck. Blunder. I hope you weren't expecting mercy. Yes, Master. I shall hasten to your aid. Oh, there's a griffin. Lay down your arms before you hurt yourself. Dare I say it? You have no need of my assistance at present, but I shall be ready to render aid at a moment's notice.
just make sure we're going the right way. I mean, yeah, we still got a long way to go. Just keep following, I guess, this big main path. Looks like we got some Saurians over here. Poisonous ones. Man, those AoE attacks just absolutely blind me. going on over here got a golem oh shit help me Lucy got to hit these like magical um I don't want to call them talismans but like they're they're symbols or something oh shit medallions or medals that's what they are Damn, Riku, Riku, you should really think about getting some health. Shit, 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 shit. Get up, Riku. Wow. Gotta help Lucy up. Holy shit, what is going on? That was crazy. I think one of the pawns has like meteor or something. I don't like the look of this. How are we to get through this door? Yeah, I don't know. That is a good question. There's a ton of bandits in this area. And high level shit, man. You're all out of luck. You'll not live to regret this. Jesus. Was impeccably timed, Arisen. I know I keep complaining about it, but man, it is super hard to see. You're all out of luck. Oh. 
Poison pinion. You're all out Yes, master. I shall hasten to your aid. Any more? Stay with me, Arisen. Wait a moment. Take out these bandits here too, because I do want to rest out of camp. We shall have to be but I really don't want to have a repeat of losing a campsite. We need reinforcements over here. <laughs> You've been doused in oil. You must stay clear of fire. Oh, is that what I should do? Riku, you're just running into more bandits. Why are you doing... Oh, my God. I'm not giving you a high five, Riku. Just got to us into even more... The fight. All right, I'm going to check around the area real quick before we rest. This seems a decent spot for a campsite. There's no reason to rush into our bedrolls. Yeah, exactly. Was excellent. I could have done no better. No, that's script. We're not resting. Because I really don't want to lose a camp. It's kit. We're just running into more and more shit. And we still got a long way to go. So let's just run. After we get that golden trove beetle. Very well. I shall return. What's this? Ow. Oh my god. Nope. 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 Oh no. Come on, ladies. Let's go. That was a whole lot of nope. Can you heal me, Lucy? I need some heals. My curative magics are at your disposal. Wait right there. Yeah, I'll worry about this stuff off recording, but for now. I want to just get through here. We've spent enough time fighting. Come on. Don't worry about those guys. You getting any closer? Yeah, we're getting closer. Rumbling runes. Yeah, well, let's keep going. Do I have anything for stamina?
Whoa, that looks pretty cool. Let's get across the bridge. Come on, ladies. What are you doing? Just run. Be wasting your time with those enemies. Well met. Does that make you the arisen? Be at ease. I bear you no ill will. My name is Manella, and I have the honor of serving as a go-between twixt Her Majesty and the Gar. Come, let me buy you a drink. We've much to discuss, and I don't fancy standing round all the while. Shall we make for the tavern? Okay, great. <laughs> we're in a cutscene while we're being attacked. Let's go, I guess, over here. Talk to this lady real quick. And then afterwards, I think we'll end the video. Where's she at? I literally just talked to her. Where the hell did she go? Have you heard? They finally caught the fiend behind those ox cart raids. Aye, they caught someone. But word is he's just an underling. Seems the true ringleader gave him the slip. Captain Benjamin's all bent up over it. Tell is, he's still interrogating the lad, trying to get all he can out of him about the Coral Snake's operations. Wants to make a clean job of it, like. Well, here's hoping it puts those snakes to rout for the welfare of this city and our stomachs. Where did this woman go? Seriously. Oh, there the she is. The people of Batal view pawns with great prejudice. They're even forbidden from setting foot in the capital. Her Majesty, Empress Nadinya, has long been troubled by this custom, but a practice so ancient isn't easily overturned. Many are unhappy about the existence of this tavern, even though it lies outside the capital, simply because it was established as a place for pawns to gather. I know not what manner of person you are, but if you would aid me in my efforts to make the people of Batal more accepting of pawns, I would be glad to offer you a residence permit. It is a bargain more than fair, for those who hold such permits may remain in back Batal without having their activities questioned. What say you? Yeah, I'll help you out. Glad I am to hear it. Take this, then. Simply show it to one of the sentries, and you'll be granted entry to the capital. Oh, and if you encounter any troubled Batali along the way, I bid you assist them. They are harsh in their persecution of the pawns, but were they to be aided by the targets of their ire, mayhap a few stubborn hearts would soften. A simple plan, I know, but is the only one available, or so it seems to me. I bid you good fortune, Sir Arisen. Well, we'll come out here, and I think we'll end the video. I'm pretty sure the pawns are going to talk. Is the elvish word for a scale cinder. I suppose we ought to pay a visit to a Batali blacksmith next. I can guide you there if you wish. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. Makes sense that they would be jabbering on. All right, here's where we're going to end the video, everybody. I want to start by telling you all thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. 
If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.